My name is Lucas Arsenal. I'm a professional kiteboarder from Prince Edward Island. I started kiteboarding when I was 13 years old. Uh, following my brother who started a few years before me. I thought it was great, I loved watching him and uh, that's all I wanted to do. Um, I practice every day that I can, but um, when it's not windy I try to do some cross training, just do some other things um, that'll get me more in shape for or help me out in kiteboarding. So overall, I do try to do things every day that's gonna help me with the sport. Kiteboard all over the island, we're very spoiled here. We can have tons of spot when within a five minute drive. The kiteboarding here has been a hidden gem for sure. I also have had quite a few opportunities to travel and kite all over the world. I've been down to South America and I kite all over the States and uh, Canada as well. So um, kiteboarding at PEI is absolutely amazing. We've got our red rocks, which makes it very unique. I mean, you, you don't see that anywhere else in the world. I mean, along with that, we got flat water, the waves. We got, we literally got it all where the island in my opinion, is by far one of the best spots to ride in the world. In the last couple of years, I won the Junior Canadian Championships. Um, from there, I went up the following years and won the men's. And this year was my first year winning the international competitions in Squamish. So i um, slowly been increasing and uh, winning more. It would definitely be one of my goals to become the world champion one day. I do love kiteboarding. It's by far my number one activity in all I do all I think about all day long. It's so satisfying to catch that wind when it's there and be free out there. I mean, we're really being pulled by the wind on the water on a board, like there's no more amazing feelings than that. So it's, it's special, there's no really a way to describe it. I'm always looking for that perfect session on the water and where the wind lines up and everything feels great. I spend six months of the year here in PEI and mostly the summer season's warmer, better. Uh, I love it here as much as I can, and then the other time of the year, the other six months, I need to be traveling south or somewhere where it's warm, where I can go in the water and keep up with the training and keep uh, competing. I do think growing up in Prince Edward Island played a big role in my career. Um, without this island, there's no way I could have done what I did. All the possibilities, kiteboarding here, you know, many times a week, almost as much as I wanted to, uh, allowed me to do what I'm doing now, so I'm, I'm very spoiled, very lucky. I was born here, I grew up here, went to school here, learned to kiteboard here, and all my family's here. I think that's something that, that's why it feels like home and it'll always be home to me. When I go somewhere, you know, I love seeing new places um, and I love seeing the world and new kite spots for sure, but um, there's something about home that I always miss and I always look forward to coming back to here. I'm proud to be an Islander. Do you have a question about PEI real estate or Prince Edward Island in general? Put it in the form below and I'll get back to you right away.